Okay, I'm gonna give you a short little drama lesson. So when I teach a class live, one of the first activities that I do is have people do a thing I call walk around the room. So first, and you can pause this between, watch the whole video and get the instructions and then pause between. Um, so the first thing I'd love you to do is just walk around the room that you're in. Might be a small office, might be a dining room. Walk around the room. Walk around the room. Okay, so that gives you an idea of just like how you walk normally when you're walking around the room. The second, the second uh, thing that I'll do is, and it depends if I'm teaching children or adults, but I'll have people walk around with a certain intention. Um, so usually a fun one would be <laughs> walk as if you are late for a meeting. <laughs> what does that look like? Walk like you are late for the meeting and it's a super important meeting. Now with this one, you'll notice some people like immediately go into caricatures of like, ah, I'm late for the meeting, looking at fake watches, that sort of thing. But generally, when we think about late for the meeting, uh, we're like, like yeah, um, tighten up. We, we wanna get somewhere, right? Um, then I'll do one that's kind of the opposite, which is just uh, <clears throat> walk around like you are early <laughs> for the meeting and don't want them to notice. <laughs> so how do you walk when you don't want to get noticed? Different, right? So what we've just done is I've shown you really like three different stories of who I am and you knew the setup, but regular me, <laughs> me when I'm late, and me when I don't wanna get noticed and I'm trying to be subtle. The acting exercise I'd love you to do next is to think it's the same thing of like moving around the room, but what I would love you to do is today do it just in the room, and maybe tomorrow just do it just in the room, but two days from now, I'd like you to try and do this acting exercise in real life in front of other people without letting them know that you're doing an acting exercise. And here's what I would like you to do. I'd like you to first maybe just stand in the room that you're in with this intention. I am awesome. I'm wise, I have something to offer. So first stand, how does it feel to stand with, I'm awesome, I'm wise, I have something to offer. And if any of these prompts feel like me, uh, like maybe you already feel that way about yourself or they don't work and you know different things, like you know your um, if you know your core career stories, like your top three in your career stories, you can use those. Um, yeah, but use choose three things that you're going to embody. I'm going to do awesome, wise, and I have something of value. And you can just take a moment even now just to ground into that and feel it coming up. Almost like from the bottom of your feet. And it's coming up your legs. And torso over your shoulders, down your arms, through your hands, up your neck, your whole head radiating out. And then let's walk around the room like we are awesome and wise and have something to offer. And just feel even how it changes your body, how it moves. 
You can spend another minute or so walking around the room and then try it tomorrow as well. And then two days from now, I would love you to go out in the world, <laughs> whether it's on a phone call, a grocery store, a meeting with your boss, and holding in your body what it feels like to feel awesome and wise and of something of value. And notice if it changes anything for you.